I left home at 11 years old. I've been on the street smoking, doing drugs. I just grew up so fast. And the life that I lived, it was, it was not good. When I got involved with Impact, I'm telling you, it helped me a whole lot. They started talking to me, telling me about Jesus, you know, and um, I knew about Jesus, but I didn't know that much. Because when I was younger, I didn't go to church. They started telling me about God, and I sat there and I was talking to them, you know. And I said, man, you know, these people are telling me some good stuff, you know. And ever since then, Impact has been good to me. I left the good and went back to the projects. We were homeless. And that's where I went wrong on letting my children out. I took a lot from them. I was bad. I was blaming the church. I started getting bitter. And I said, look what I've done to myself. You had all this, but you let it go for this. When I found out he was gone, oh man, it just like something just left for me. I hated that it took for that to happen to David for me to come back to God. And now I'm back. And I feel much better that I'm back in church, but I'm hurt because I don't have my son. But like I said, impact has been good to me. All y'all, I'm running for Jesus right now. That's what I need. I need him. If I could be here every day, I would. I'm not lying to you. I come in, Dennis has the music going. I'm sitting there and I'm praying, asking God to help me for all my wrongs, you know, to lead me and guide me, to take me on to the next week. You know, I just sit there and I get a peace of mind. If you don't have church family, you have nothing. People are here to love on you, to help you. Impact helps a whole bunch of people. Impact is just awesome. If y'all could just donate and help, you would not regret it because it's going for a good cause. It really is.